Edgar Snyder made sure that whether we went to Indiana County or whether we went to Smithport, Pennsylvania, or whether we were in Pittsburgh, that we traveled to our clients to make sure that they were represented. Edgar kind of tipped the world upside down and said, we're there to help you. We'll come to your house. We'll come to the hospital. We'll help you make a difference. We are lawyers, but we don't represent big companies or corporations. We represent regular people. We have efforts, for instance, with the recent uh, hurricane. Uh, the firm will match any funds that are uh, donated uh, by our employees. We do that a lot. Uh, a lot of our employees are uh, involved in their own uh, communities where they do uh, missionary work and at our uh, quarterly meetings and, and holiday parties we uh, call out everybody uh, for their own individual efforts. I was quite frankly overwhelmed with how caring and how much they wanted to make a difference. I think what happens in our society a lot now is people talk about making a difference. They talk about caring but you really know what people believe not by what they say but by what they do. People who have a means to help others should help others. And that's always been a hallmark of who Edgar Snyder was. Give back, it's important. I was uh, just getting in, involved when I started this law firm. And within five or 10 years, I really just started my own uh, volunteer life and realizing uh, that this is really what it's all about. So I think the, the inspiration of what I'm doing and giving it back to community and trying to imbue the people that work for me, uh, trying to live by it myself, have, have really been uh, uh, a continuing force for me uh, in terms of uh, how I live my life and how the law firm has really uh, tried to uh, be a community player. We teamed up with Cam Hayward and um, Cam um, runs his own charity which is called the Hayward House and we've teamed up with uh, Josh Bell and Josh Bell does um, a lot of work with um, uh, blessings in a backpack and with uh, community food banks. We've also teamed up with Chris Letang who is a Pittsburgh Penguin and he's a very big supporter of boys and girls clubs. They helped us dramatize um, the My Voice program, which provides a communication device to kids who are nonverbal or have a communication disorder. It's a really hidden problem. And that's why when you get ESA jumping in to dramatize, like they do with Tyler and other kids um, in, in their TV spots, it helps bring the whole community. I think people end up going, oh, well, we can be part of making that change. But I love it when I say to her, Mom, how'd you find out about it? She says, Edgar Snyder and Associates, ESA. I mean, how cool is that? Talk about making real change. Somebody sees it on TV, and their child who's never ridden a bike is now riding a bike. So the partnership with them has just been, um, quite frankly, profoundly meaningful to me personally, let alone what we've done for the kids. We've given a loud voice to some charities that I don't think had a loud one before. So uh, we've helped with uh, food shortages, uh, hunger with uh, young people, and people in Pittsburgh is a big uh, part of what uh, we uh, support here. Uh, many safety-related uh, charities uh, are also uh, in the forefront of uh, our efforts. Uh, supporting uh, wearing helmets, giving away uh, bike helmets. We feel that it's um, our responsibility, you know, as members of this community, we live in this community right alongside everybody else. We feel it's our responsibility to help out those people who might need a little help. Change is happening because we're supporting the parents and we wouldn't have been able to make the difference be as far as we are for so many thousands of kids now without ESA. And I would like to congratulate them on getting this award from class. It's fantastic. ESA deserves it. And they're a model for our community. So on a public scale, we've taken that platform of advertising and said to uh, many of the charitable uh, places that we do business with, whether it's the food bank, 
whether it's backpack without kits, whether it's variety for bikes, you name it, uh, uh, public safety, don't text and drive, things of this nature. We have used this platform to help them be able to get their message out because the one thing that nonprofits really lack is that extra buck to really be able to certainly not go on television and be able to necessarily give their message because they're trying to give as much uh, of the monies that they have to the cause in which they are. Exactly. We have set the standard. I'm not saying that no other law firm does this because there are law firms that do plenty of good things charitably. But we have this public forum because of advertising. We're very, very well known. And when I think of the contribution, I think more and more we're being known as a, a community player. I think we're being known as people that care a lot about other people in our community. To me, I think that is really a major contribution as public uh, people that we can give.